In this underground laboratory, China hopes to solve some of the world's deepest mysteries. This giant sphere, measuring 35 meters in diameter, is filled with liquid and fitted with light-detecting phototubes. It's designed to study elusive particles known as neutrinos. They're difficult to detect because they have no electrical charge, very little mass, and move at nearly light speed. They can also pass through normal objects unimpeded. One neutrino can change to another neutrino uh, at a flight. Um, so such a special um, property um, may have a big impact to the um, um, nature, uh, how nature works and how the universe evolves. So we don't know the answer yet. That's why we need the Juno experiment to measure the property of the neutrino and uh, get the answer uh, of the fundamental rules of our nature. The Jiangmen Underground Neutrino Observatory, or Juno for short, is a 376 million US dollar undertaking. Juno is expected to be the first of several next generation neutrino detectors around the world. The US and Japan also have their own detectors expected to be operational by 2028. Even if they make any scientific breakthroughs, immediate applications of such findings remain unclear. Still, China is racing to beat other countries in solving one of the biggest mysteries of particle physics. The one in the US will be six years behind us, and the one in France and in Japan will be two or three years later than us. So uh, we believe that we can get the result of uh, mass hierarchy uh, ahead of everybody. The project is an international effort with a team of 750 researchers from over a dozen countries and regions. Installation of China's detector is expected to be completed by late November 2024. The facility will reportedly start collecting data from August 2025. Juno will also be used to study astronomical objects like the sun and supernovas.